I'm drawing so what a did you do with name. this man baby costume? You checked for poop and well, like I can't pretend to be his mom. Like that's just wrong. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I'll help you find your mom. Uh, oh, I and see. And then he starts sucking on my titties, and I'm like, oh, it's okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Pillow Talk. <laughs> can't sing but welcome to the show babies ladies and gentlemen welcome back to your favorite podcast this is pillow talk i'm your host ryan pownell we're joined by mr quickie at they call me dark we are also co-hosted as you saw in last week's episode with the goat adriana <laughs> chetrick it's your babysitter aka oh. ashley skies aka Hello. starts with a j yes that's me yeah yes <laughs> but today today our guest Wow. Is a beautiful porn star. Yep. One of the greatest up and comers. I like how tall she is. I thought she was Aww. young. I like how natural and large her breasts are. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing against fakies. Yeah. Thank you. Because <laughs> those are sculpted perfectly as well. Darky. By God. We love you. <laughs> Why don't you guys just fuck already? This is Kendra Sunderland. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hi, Kendra. Hi. Spencer Michael put us in touch. What a Spencer legend. Spencer Michael. Have you fucked him? Of course. How was it? <laughs> it's great. Spencer's great. Who's your favorite male porn star? Um, I don't know. Probably Johnny Sins, but I feel like everybody mm. says that. Literally yeah. everybody. And you know what? He's uh, my favorite male porn star. Me too. Yeah. I've pretended to be him. I've pretended to have his dick <laughs> many fucking times. Every time. <laughs> Yeah, that's that. right. He's right? actually more Google than that's okay. Most female porn stars by men. Yeah, wow. And I yeah. feel like yeah. my friends don't count. Like I love my friends that are porn stars, but I feel like that doesn't count as my favorite. You, you ever know? have sex with Kieran Lee? <sighs> unfortunately, yes. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I'm getting Wait, why unfortunately? unfortunately? Why? Yeah, the unfortunate says, part. Johnny <laughs> gets yeah. the thank God the I fucked him <laughs> and Kieran Lee. Because I bet I think he's a bit of a troll. He's a jokester. He is a troll. Yeah, he's a jokester. He said some mean things he's about me on the internet in three oh. episodes. And he oh, made yeah. fun of my nails, and I was like, "Really? Wait, I love your nails. Thank you. Yes. You want to hear my Kieran Lee impression? Oh, those are sure. good back scratchers. In my scratchers. butt, though. In yeah. the butt. Wow. Oh, what? So For you can sure. bleed to death on this? Is it sharp? <laughs> They're not sharp right now. Babysitter, I had a feeling that we were maybe gonna hook up tonight, so I actually clipped my nails and I actually did this to them. Whatever oh, that's called. Oh, bless Fire. your heart. I filed them. Same. They look nice. Yes. I love. <laughs> so Kieran Lee's going to be on, uh, we're filming with him on Tuesday, mm -hmm. and uh, we want to get all the dirt on him. So whatever you got. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Please spill. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Can I chime in? Yes. <laughs> 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 if it's Kieran Lee, Everyone, it's Adrian of course. Everyone, it's Adrian Chechen! Okay, I, I'm only going to chime in for like one second. Kieran um, Lee. But here's Babysitter. the thing. Here's the thing. Um, Go right in the mic. Yeah. Okay, so here's the thing. Kieran Lee tends to man blanket because he thinks his man blanket is the best. What's a man blanket? blanket? You know what a man blanket is? No. Okay, lean your head back a little bit. <laughs> I'm the star. Oh, no oh way. Way. he likes to cover the girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Take yeah, the yeah. Clout. yeah, which is like, okay, Kieran Lee, cool. But here's the thing. He likes a man blanket. But here's something else, oh. and you might know this, and then I'm gonna pop out. But Kieran Lee is definitely afraid of cotton balls. Oh my God! <laughs> yes. Good to know. Yes. Should we prank thing. him? Yes. He I will cry. He will panic. Run. He'll break down. <laughs> really? And I'm gonna He's run. got a phobia. I actually do too, to be honest. Cotton balls. Of <laughs> cotton balls? Ah. Why? You open Advil, and that it's just so soft and squishy, and I can't. Pussy. Yeah, I don't you get bet. it. I don't get Let it. Let me guess. You man blanket too. <laughs> They, no, no. They want a Baby sandpaper. They want sandpaper. Here's my Kieran okay. impression. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, oh, I already yeah. laughed. Oh, suck that cook. <laughs> suck that. Suck it, baby. Suck it. Suck Wait, it. does he have an accent? Suck it. Yeah. Oh my god. Was that, that a good one? Yeah. Okay. Kieran Lee. Like 50 minutes of that, and it's the same thing. 50. Yeah. 50. Yeah. I can't yeah. wait for him hey, to sit in that way, chair. By the way, that's one thing. Look, yeah, I'm a chronic masturbator. I'm very, very into porn. I love porn probably more than anyone that's in the world. Great. Anyone that I've ever met. I love porn. <laughs> and I'm very it's vocal right about it. It's right by his bed. Yeah, my yeah. VR kit, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Full blast. <laughs> we, might, we might virtually go at it tonight, Kendra. We have before. Okay. We're on the beach, I believe. Yeah. Oh, cute. Yeah. It was quite lovely. Yeah. Building sand castles that knocked over. And fucking. And we fucked. Yeah, okay. I had a good time. This is like the sad reality of porn. Is it like is, it really is. We're really the bridge. We're the bridge the between. If you don't know it now, you know. <laughs> Can you know it's, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's the one time Ryan had a nine inch <laughs> cock, so. Yes. He no, remembers. actually, contrary. <laughs> wow. In VR porn, they're very thoughtful. They <laughs> use. They use men with small penis, smaller penises. Smaller penises. <laughs> average penises. They use average yeah. dicks for VR porn, correct? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I was with Mick Blue. I feel like he's like thick. 
I don't know. It's not like super. I feel like longer would be better because you're like behind the camera or whatever. It's really hard. Yeah, because look, in, in, so in 2D to porn, film it. which to me now is ancient era. Yeah, that jerk off to a screen. That's like uh. that's like renting DVDs, you know? <laughs> yeah, exactly. What do you do? Yeah, then? VR porn now they're using normal sized dicks, which I appreciate because you know if I'm gonna morph myself into this body, especially when I'm on high mm. metabols, I really believe that I'm there. You know, yeah, I wait my screen. I I wait till it loads seven k. Can't have you. Freeze. It'll be a school night. It'll go to four in the morning. For fucking, and then <laughs> if I see Johnny Sins is fucking perfectly looped up cock. Gorgeous um, vascular circumcised. That beautiful thing. You I actually it. skip videos in VR porn. Which with big dicks, but I think Wanks mm. is catching up. But Doink is still using big dicks, so but Doink's got to step their shit up. <laughs> Anyways, what's Take it like notes. to film VR porn? I mean, it's not bad. You get a break like every fifteen minutes, so I kind of like that. Mm. Why? Why are they giving you? It's a, a lot of work for the girl. They have to like move everything to switch the camera angle and everything. So like, are they strapped to the guy's chest? Like, is it like a what no, kind it's, of it's goggles? Correct. No, the one that I shot, they're just like right in front of him. Like he just has to lean back really far. And oh, they no shut way. their fucking like, the camera. They do not. I've speak. only shot one though, so I'm not really like. Imagine you know, you're getting statistically, by I don't know the one answers. of these three beautiful ladies. So wait, yeah. how do you how do you get into filming a VR porn? Because I would love to do that. And I would love for you to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm con I'm contracted to browsers, so. Mm. Hey, it's <laughs> cute. <laughs> I'm sorry. So like I just have to put like a little bit in here. So like VR porn is like the worst thing to film ever. I believe it. It's so fucking annoying because here's the thing. VR porn sets are an average of eight to twelve hours. Wow. Okay. What? Why? Because so it breaks. takes them an hour and a half to set up the camera, navigate the camera, make sure it's okay. So here's the thing. When you're fucking somebody <laughs> in VR, the camera is right here, like she said. And you're there like this. But then not only that, you have to like whisper in the fake ears and like yes. get in close. Yeah, I like that. that <laughs> and like it's a little too much. Right? Right? Yeah. But also, they want you to do probably about 12 positions, five minutes each. Mm. So imagine 12 times five. What is that? I want to make sure you do math. That's 60. That's an hour, baby girl. Well, I'm sorry. What? You're so quick. That's 60. That's an hour, oh, baby girl. Oh, he's okay. quick. Okay. 48. So they We're want to space together. So they want you to do that amount of fucking in intervals, okay? In intervals. So in between you have an hour break or 30 40 minute break. So the moment your pussy gets wet, they say cut, time for a new position. Uh, Fuck. Right? And you have no interaction with the male performer. On top of that, if you're a squirter, you ruin the fucking camera. One time I got yelled at for ruining the camera. Remember that scene? It was with Riley. Yeah. It's my favorite one. You got yelled at yeah. for that? Yeah, be I told them beforehand to put a plastic bit of a bag cheap on room, it. by the way, on that scene. <laughs> so VR <laughs> porn, most so VR porn is torture for the, the performers. Um, so most performers <laughs> that I know, most high-end performers, like herself, um, actually will not shoot VR porn. Y you you are promoting unsustainable porn. I'm out. Thank She's you. So funny. I love her. Do you so know what it does to them? I know. That's torture. <laughs> wow. So I was like, I don't know Be the answer. Beauty is pain. Yeah. You know, <laughs> beauty is pain. So what, what is your favorite porn to shoot, Kendra Sunderland? I like interracial. Fuck yeah. Why? Because <laughs> I like black eyes. <laughs> really? Is it the color? Thanks different? for tuning in to Peloton. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Would okay. You, would you like to step wow. in? Wow. We've already met. Yeah. Please. Did you already get his He's number? Hot. He's yeah, hot. He's yeah, he is very hot. hot. Oh, you guys are so funny. Let's I'm let's talk out. more about your your uh, preference in men. Okay. I believe the scene that we had sex in virtually was a white guy. Yes. Mm. You don't discriminate. Do they just have to have a, a dick bigger than most black men? No, like I'll fuck any race, but like I want to end up with a black guy. Is there anyone you won't fuck a race? Is that racist to ask? No, <laughs> I would say yeah. I, it's not based off race. It's based off like personality. A Correct me if I'm wrong, go. but porn stars do not like. Indian men. I don't. I don't feel like we discriminate on anyone. Can you name one? Like Indian if anyone filmer? loves porn stars more, it's Indian men, honestly. So I just hear like the because we, fans. you know, now we know the porn girls a lot, and they all bobs and vagines send bobs and vagines. Yeah. yeah, but India is so yeah, big. So I bet fun, you though. there's a male porn star in India that is a fucking legend. I think there's more subscribers. So. Yeah, you don't think so? Nope. <laughs> We're gonna find him. <laughs> Show bobs is like iconic, so I don't know. I think it's hilarious. Okay. Show Bobs. Show Bobs. <laughs> show Bobs. Let's show them. They used to say that on my lives like all the time. And then I did and I got in trouble. So. 
What is that? What showing bobs is like showing your tits. They meant to say boobs, obviously. Oh, show your bo- <laughs> yeah. bobs and vagina. Show and your vagine. show me your bobs. Please. So, what is your thing? Uh, of course, you have lovely breasts. What are they? Double D thirty two. I want to say natural I'd milk say factories. I'd say right now they're like a triple D, maybe. Uh, why? Because you're compare? about to start your period. Or yeah, something? let's compare. Can we compare? Sure. Yeah, that'd be great. I'm like, wow. Take them out. Oh. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting creepier every episode, Eric. Like... Ah, you were creepy since episode one. Oh my god, these are huge. I pay for these. She did not. Very nice. So is tit fuck a big part of your uh, your whole thing? I feel like anything involving my tits is, yeah. Like, yeah, absolutely. It's I'm part all, of your brand. I always have to do like reverse cowgirl and like face the camera, which is like so exhausting for me. Mm. I smoke oh, yeah. a lot Lots of, of legwork. So I get like exhausted, <laughs> yeah. You smoke before a shoot? I smoke all the time. Hey, by the way, <laughs> now that we're kind of getting in, we're, we're, we're meeting people and they're telling us secrets about the industry. Okay. And I've heard there's a little bit of a problem with the up and coming porn stars with Xanax addiction. Oh, really? Is this true? Maybe. <laughs> do, do, we, do we not want to touch on this? We could. we could. I don't care. I think that, I mean, I think I'm hearing a lot of the up and comers are bailing on porn shoots because of their Xanax addiction. And why are they doing Xanax? Is this true? I think that some people maybe want a release from reality and want to relax hmm. to the fullest. Before a shoot, after you know, a shoot, everything in between. I have. I have. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, I, I, I'm going to, like, I'm really going to try my hardest to stop. But, like, no, here's, a, here, here's, here's the thing. It's a great question. Here's the thing. I'm going to, I'm going to put you guys in your place. Right. Because you should never perpetuate rumors that you actually don't know fact to. And um, the Xanax addiction you're 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 wanting to perpetuate on the he Internet. Did, not me. You, you, sir, um, <laughs> could just be hearsay and most likely is hearsay. Because if you actually want to be a top model, a top performer, you have to stay sober. You have to take care of your body. You are a sexual athlete. Yes. So. Don't you ever perpetuate a Xanax addiction again. Been told. Because what you hear as a drama spoken in a podcast might act- not actually be the truth. Tough questions get tough answers, Ron. No. That's right. God ever. damn it. I like her. Don't ever. Love her. Love oh her. my God. Thank you, Adriana. Thank, Thank you, baby. Never coming back. <laughs> She's lying. I love She's it. She's lying. <laughs> That turned me on. <laughs> I was, I'm falling out of my <laughs> shirt. It was Ooh, so hot. Why am I hurt like, from that? My uh, neck pussy's wet. I think we're all turned on from that. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> my neck I need is a Xanax. Red. I really, I really <laughs> did want to compare red. nipple size and everything. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> to be honest, I might win the nipple size. I, I want to see. I just, I'm so curious okay. right now. Well, so it's YouTube will blur it out. It will blur it out. It's no problem. So Kendra, I'm so confused. What? You're from Oregon. To, oh, okay. We we were gonna compare. She wants to compare size. nipple size, and Fuck you want to talk about Oregon? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, don't interrupt. Please. Like, let's talk about Oregon. Okay. Let's talk like, about the ducks. Do I pop Bro, my so biggest heavy. one or wow. my smallest one? Holy oh. potatoes! Oh. Move your mic. Yeah, she's hers is a little. Yeah. Very oh. nice. You, you win. Like this thing is hard to move. These two sets of boobs are very different on the spectrum. You know, like. Fake. I like your nipples a lot. I, I like really like yours. And the really? fact that they're pierced right now. Thank you. That's hot. That's funny. I got called pepperoni nipples when like my first nude got out. And I was like, I feel like they're like <laughs> proportionate to my titties. Absolutely. 100% they are. Wait, who leaked your first nude? Some guy that was like upset I wouldn't date him. So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What's his name? <laughs> Story checks out. <laughs> I think it's Mario. I forget though. Wow. Fuck Mario. <laughs> and, and fuck that, Tyler. Because he was my Luigi. first leaker. I'm dead. Tyler. Yes. I mean, I have like people leaking stuff to think for my whole career, so I can't, I don't know. Hey, amen. You know? Absolutely. Hey, but it is fucked up. Let me ask you a question. So what happens when something gets leaked? What? Are, what's the next step? You get a I, good team. I became famous, so I don't know. <laughs> like I know. I think it's it worked just, out for Kim K. Oh, <laughs> sorry. She's running. It fucking did. It, it really did. Worked yeah. out for it Paris. Was, I think yeah. if you like ride Those that ride, then it'll work out for you. Yes. But also, like if you just like, you don't suck at sex. True that. Yeah, if you hey. really are naturally like a sex born, like you okay. want to have sex. Is it illegal, by the way, for someone to take an OnlyFans video and post it on a forum? Is that illegal? Absolutely. Yeah, it's copyright. So what happens? To Reddit is people. Can they go to jail? What happens? Yeah, Reddit is Can you sue them? Yes. How do you get it taken mm, down? Can. A lot of questions. You can do everything. <laughs> yeah. All like, of the above. She to come in again. <laughs> check, check, check. You write a cease and desist. That's the first yeah. thing. Yeah. Good. That's yeah. a tongue twister. Because right. our good friend Nathan Webb, our best friend in LA, 
Oh, yeah. Uh, he has an OnlyFans, and he posted pictures of his penis. Mm -hmm. And they leaked all over the internet. Of yeah. course they yeah. did. Yeah. Cease and desist, and then you see the fuck out of everyone who's ever posted it. And you put it, you put everything you put on uh, any type of site, you can put a small um, watermark stamp of numbers, not a watermark. You can actually put a nice traceable number code to everything you put on the internet. So when they like leak an it, NFT, you know exactly who leaked it, and you can ban them everywhere. Oh. Smart. I told Nathan smart, smart. Space. I told Nathan it was, it, was pro, it was proper <laughs> exactly. marketing for him. Exactly. Yeah, absolutely. It, was, it was great marketing for absolutely. him. <laughs> okay, so yes. uh, you're doing OnlyFans, of course. Of course, everyone is. Yes. Yeah. You're, you're making moolah. Mm -hmm. You're doing your thing. Yes. What can your viewers expect to see? Titties. <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> I hope so. Do you do at home uh, guy girl? I do both. So I do like at home stuff and then I like a full production, like hair and makeup, like pictures, laundry. Because you know what I'm respecting very much about the community is that y'all are becoming very smart entrepreneurs. You're becoming producers, directors, writers, editors. Yeah. Right? All, of, all of it. I it's love a good like yeah. holiday Porn scene. back in the day was very different. You show up and you know, you were the talent. Now girls are coordinating to make their own full productions mm -hmm. and and i buy these videos i'm a big porn guy yeah and it's just as fucking good yeah very it's impressive fun to like come up with concepts and stuff like that yeah and it's shit that you want to do yeah. yeah like for my that's christmas what I like about scene it. i know I got, that this like, is what they wanted to put out yeah and I, and I vibe with that for my christmas scene i got like stuck under a table putting like milk and cookies for santa and then he like comes in and finds me and santa came in and, and you came up with yeah. this right yeah well, I mean, like, cool? it's just stuck porn, like, yeah. anyone, you know. Big were you were you a part of OnlyFans when you were allowed to do, like, vegetables and, like, things of that yeah. sort? Yeah. It Let me ask you this. <laughs> Big companies like MindGeek, mm -hmm. which, of course, own browsers, Pornhub. Yeah. Are they kind of getting a little threatened and intimidated by OnlyFans? I don't think so. I think browsers is thriving, maybe because I'm just, like, with them, I feel that way. But I feel like people are always, like, old school people are going to want to see which, like of course, websites. is owned by Canadians. Yes. The fit hey. pervert capital of the universe. Isn't that crazy? Canada. Canada yeah. is the first place I traveled once I became library girl, actually. And I, I love it. Oh, you're a library girl. This She's is library, library girl. girl. <laughs> library yes. girl babysitter. Why are you? Yes. Yes. Cool. Yes. We go hand in hand. We yeah. absolutely do. <laughs> How many books have you rented from a library? Um, when I was in school, maybe like a couple. I don't know. I've been out of school for a really long time. It was Oregon State University. No? Have you ever had Go sex Beeves. in an actual library without consent from the library? Yes. Fair enough. Yeah. Works for me. Yeah. Quiet or loud? Everybody does. I feel like I that's why I was like so shocked when I became library girl because I was like, how is this so shocking to everyone? Like, pretty shocking. Yeah. Everyone in the college is James, like fucking sex everywhere. In the that's what yeah. I want to touch on. Yeah. How come Oregon is such a common city in porn? Because hot girls come from Oregon. Is that what it is? Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. Mormons. <laughs> Mormons. <laughs> it's just yeah. about Mormons. What kind, of, what kind of trouble would you get in if you got caught in a library? Uh, I got charged with public indecency and a thousand dollar fine. I'm not allowed in the library anymore. Either. Library girls actually banned from libraries. And that one made, library, I'm yeah. not banned from other libraries. <laughs> I had the idea to like go to other libraries and like go to college campuses. Yeah, make it your thing. And fuck yes. guys in their dorms, like sit outside with like a table. Like, do you want to film a porn in your dorm? And then I realized I was like highly illegal and what I got in trouble for in the first place. Yeah, fair. So I was like, I gave up that dream. It's almost yeah. like you're a Batman of porn in the sense that. Yeah. I think my thing is like public indec yeah. indecency. Right. Because the I police need Batman in Gotham. Yeah. <laughs> they can't kill the, the villains without him. They're very necessary. But technically mm -hmm. they're trying to get rid of him. Eh. But they need him. What's the craziest place you've had sex in public? Jinx likes her. <laughs> uh, Jinx, she likes black guys. <laughs> Two to the left. <laughs> Jinx, she I stops. Probably like the Taco Bell drive through You fucked in a Taco Bell drive through Yeah. I did Sonic. Were you fucking before you that. ordered? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. It was a long ordered. line. They Fair. were taking forever. Okay. In Fair the enough. driver's seat. What better to do than fuck? Exactly. In the car. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. Yeah. Right before food. That's great. And then talk, you get Taco Bell right afterwards. Yeah, like, yeah. Shouldn't eat Taco Bell before. It's like smoking yeah. a cigarette afterwards. Of course. You didn't get Taco Bell deniability. It's their fault. Yeah, yes. you took too long. Yeah. That's so great. True that. Did you wow. have hot sauce? Hot <laughs> sauce? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, See I like mild. Oh. <laughs> Would you like to play Miss Quick? Yes, let's do it. Okay. All right. 
Kendra Sunderland. Oh, Kendra. God. I'm Mr. Quickie. Okay. Do you want to know why they call me Mr. Quickie? Because you're quick. Yes, at everything I do, including sex. Love you have it. 60 seconds. You answer. went long last night, Dark. Did I? <laughs> oh, really? Oh, yeah. Really? You guys went I'm rounds. I'm scared. Okay. I did my VR thing and you were still going. Yeah? <laughs> Sorry. No. Uh, anyways, you have 60 to seconds to answer as many questions as you can, as quickly as you can. Oh, God. I'm not good off the top of my head. No, it's okay. okay. These are these usually are yes or no. Yeah. Oh, okay. Usually, I usually, could, yeah. I could do that. Starting now, in 2015, you became famous in the porn industry for masturbating in an Oregon State Library, landing you a public, public indecency fine. How many masturbation videos on OnlyFans would it take to pay off that ticket today? One. <laughs> According to Google, Oregon is only 2.2% African American, making it a very white state. Did yes. you go from innocent university cam girl to taking five big black cocks in a gangbang scene <laughs> for the same reasons a middle-aged gay man fresh out of the closet downloads Grinder? <laughs> Deprivation. Good question, Dark. Yes. <laughs> wow, I nailed that. I, I reverse engineered that. Wow, I'm so proud of Do you know why I... there's not, not many black people in Oregon, though? Why? It was illegal for them to own property up until like the 70s oh, or 80s. Oh, they were the most racist state forever. I know. That's why I'm going to find a nice black man and go back there and, and have, have a family lots of babies. Of yeah, cute light skinned babies. Good for you, Kendra. <laughs> Fuck yes. All right. Ready? Next question. You Do like? you ever date or bang Asian men? Date, no. <laughs> Bang sometimes. Okay. If you're ever going to get married, what is the minimal dick size for you to say I do? Seven inches. Shit. Cool. Good Sorry. for you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Is your grandma still <laughs> mad at you for doing what you did in that, that day in the library? No. They actually weren't mad the day of. They are just like, that's cool. Oh, really? Wait, yeah. your grandma is aware of the, of the charges? I mean, I was on like the news in my hometown. Like, I was on the oh. news every is time. Is that what came up the name? Yeah, that's how I became like who I am today is because of that. And you said, fuck it. You changed your IG to library girl and you just went. Yeah, for it. I mean, honestly, it's funny. People are like, I like applaud you for running with it, but I'm like, what else would I do? Just like stay in Salem, Oregon and like work at a diner and like do what I was doing? Essentially, it's like, cancel no, culture. Like, you gonna... either. Up let them cancel you or you don't. True that. You fucking yeah. bull through it. You no, know? I feel like I've always like ran with it. Like even when they called me pepperoni nipples, like I took a picture with pepperoni pizza over my nipples and I posted yes. it. So I was like, yes, yes, Fuck yes. You guys. And by the way, every girl with massive tits has larger nipples. Thank it's, you. It's proportionate. It's proportionate. I realized once I started webcamming that like there's millions of people out there. Like people loved my nipples, like even like. The way she said it, yeah, like lovely. they love it, hey, so I'm just like, we like them over those, here too. those boobs are perfect, Thank fucking you. gorgeous. Thanks. How's That's the booty? Perfect. It's all right. <laughs> it's always a working progress. You can't stop I, working I on like it. It's butt. okay. I do. You work it out. You squat. I I Bear, work out. I had surgery Bumble. recently on like a a hernia. I had like a hole above my abdomen. Jesus, these injuries. Yeah. Was it from fucking? I don't know. I got it when I was like younger, but I stitched it up. But like, it's like it'll come back. So maybe it was very dangerous sport. Would you call it? Porn is very dangerous. Oh, yeah. Se sexual Bro, athlete. her sexual like athlete. neck is like isn't yeah. your neck no, like no, so she fucked? She performed for a company for a while. She was. You're. A, she's a sexual. Athlete. You were a sexual, sexual athlete. athlete. Like, Thank you. The Absolutely. Hours on set for her. You're a sexual. Uh, athlete. Fucking right. Thank you. That 12. means a lot coming from her, honestly. What a legend, right? It's an no. appreciation, apparently, hey, throughout yeah. the industry. Oh, thank you. She's yeah, awesome. and she said this before you got here. Aww. She's not just being nice. Thank you. She said very nice things She's about so you. so kind. So, Adriana Chachek, okay, she's here. She's, like, crazy. She's, <laughs> in, in, like, she's God, right? I love it. We call her Tom Brady. Is she Tom Brady? Oh, yeah. Yes. Duh. She's Tom Brady. Obviously. <laughs> Team Brady. So I feel like the, I'm never retiring. the first time I saw her. <laughs> seven seven super uh, That's a great relevant joke. I hope I retire. Never, never retiring. Retire. <laughs> yeah. Yes. She's a goat. I mean, yeah, I, I can right. only fantasize about doing things that she does. Do you crazy. aspire to get to her level one day? I don't think I could. Honestly. Whoa, Kendra. I can't. Hey, I she probably said this down, uh, at some point in her career. And you are doing great. No, You're I feel like she's always been able to do crazy stuff. Well, she had the that first time I saw her was it was actually like a picture of her. She had like a dog toy in her ass. It was like the biggest ball I've oh, ever seen Kong? in my life. The Kongs? It was a picture at like a convention she was signing, and I was like, oh my god! Wow! And ever since then, I've been like flabbergasted. Now, everything. The best place to buy sex toys 
is the is pet smart because they're safe for your body and they come in all types of shapes and sizes. Okay, just and for the no listeners, just for the listeners that didn't hear that, um, Adriana Chechik said the best place to buy sex toys is the is Pet Smarts because it comes in all shapes and sizes. We love it, <laughs> and they're safe for your body. <laughs> you put peanut butter in there too, or what, for the dog to look at? Uh, sometimes. Yeah. I care for Ryan. <laughs> Only the goat. Mac, Mac and cheese. Out of fun superstore is for rookies. Have you ever put peanut butter on your hoo to let your dog lick it off? No. Okay. Whoa. Did well, you've never heard that, that one before? No, of course. I just didn't think people did it. Oh, okay, but I asked it. <laughs> hey, what is the, in your opinion, the weirdest thing you've done? That I've done? Yeah, that even made you cringe even a little bit. Even you went the next day, <laughs> you're like, Shit. You're like, well, God <laughs> damn. What the fuck was that? Really did it this time. What really kind of, you know, blew your mind? There's... <laughs> <laughs> it's so embarrassing, but it's, oh. it's on the internet, so it's fine. Yeah, it's... There's Get a certain Google porn star that I did a scene with, and it was like a content trade, and so he told me that I was going to be like his college girlfriend, we were going to come home... Meet his dad and we we're going to like fuck all over the house. I get there and he's like, oh, the extra didn't show up. But I have this giant man baby costume. And I was like, OK. <laughs> this is great. And he was like, you know, because like milk, like, you know, like titties and stuff. Mother's I was like, milk, milk, milk factories. OK. So then I like went through with it because I. loves that costume. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> I just, you know, I want to pay him back or whatever. I honestly could have said something, but I was like, whatever, just go with it. I didn't think anyone was going to see it, to be honest. <laughs> and yeah, I had like a giant man baby costume and he made me like. Like open up his diaper and be like, "Oh, did you have?" <laughs> <laughs> no, no. no. <laughs> and like to this day, like people haunt me about that. Like my friends will like crack jokes about it. What website is that one on? It was um the dark web. What's his name? I forget his name. Producer Jenks, let's throw that link in the bio. <laughs> I I'm drawing so a blank on his name. So what did you do with this man baby costume? You checked for poop and... Well, like, I can't pretend to be his mom. Like, that's just wrong. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I'll help you find your mom. Uh, oh, I see. And then see. he starts sucking on my titties and I'm like, oh, it's okay. Like, he can There's stay with here me. Too. Hot babysitter content. Yeah. TBH. Yeah, you should get a oh man, my God. A man I need a man costume. baby. I'll order it tonight. Amazon Prime. Ryan's my baby right there. Well, he's a man baby, yes. You would okay. make a really good man baby, to be honest. I don't know if that's, like, weird to say, but, like, you have Wait, the face... Wait, which one? Both of them? No, like... Well, no, him. Like, okay. You would make a really good man baby. I appreciate that. A binky would look real nice. What would I make? A lumberjack. Thank you. That's cool. Yeah. I'll chop your wood. <laughs> hey, which scene are you kind of fed up with? That one. The plot, the lumberjack? <laughs> <laughs> no, the baby one. No, the man well, baby course. one, dude. <laughs> of course. But, you know, there's there's like 10 main ones. Now it's getting more creative, I must admit. Mm. But which one is it like, are you, like, you, you check your, your call sheet and you kind of go, oh, fucking pizza boy again. You know, yeah. which one drives it, you know, you're like, what scene is the one you're just like, oh, are right. you kidding? We're still doing, it's 2022 for fuck's sakes. We're still doing that. Which one is that for you? Um... I don't know. I feel like just like cheating. I feel like that's what I get a lot. I don't get I any like, like stepbrother, like step stuff. So I know that if I got that a lot, I would probably get like a of it. Fox Neighbor might be my favorite. Yeah. To be honest. But Pool boys. Hey, have you ever done the one? What's the one? Uh, the website? It's where it's a real estate agent. And uh. what's, what's that <laughs> one called? Uh, I love that one so much. I like the way it's shot. It's always POV. Mm. It's always HD. The girls are always gorgeous. Really like that one. I actually subscribed to it for about a year. Yeah, I don't know. I've always been on contract, so I don't like, I don't branch out. I just like. You're just straight browsers? I have been, yeah. Good for you. For like the past couple of years. Because to us, normal, you know, people out of the industry, browsers are civilians. Like yes. Civilians. Browsers is looked at as like, you know, Netflix. Yeah, they're yeah. cool. HBO. You yeah, know what I mean? It really is. It's the creme de la creme. Yeah. Yeah. They're cool. And I'll tell you what I hate, but fuck, they're good at marketing. Mm. You're, you're really getting to it. And I'm, I'm a guy that, you know, I like to finish when I like to time it with the guy. The cum shot at the yeah, end. Yeah, you want to pretend and that's your fuck, dick. The fucking hub, man, gets me every time. You know, you're watching this 10 minute preview video, whatever. Yeah. And then subscribe. And you're like, you fucking bastard. The amount of orgasms I've had looking at a an ad. Yeah. I'll always <laughs> rewind it. Me, like, I'll destroys rewind me. it to a part that I like and just rewatch that same part over and over again. I do that too. It's so weird. You guys should know that Kendra was actually a very big pioneer for. Vixen, Blacked, and all of the um, 
uh, Vixen media. She she actually has mm-hmm. always been above Love the Vixen. rest when it comes to porn. She's always been a contract girl because she was also a pioneer and created such beautiful work for these companies that they actually mimicked the stuff that she had created to create their own style. Are you a creative mogul? I I think so. That's very sweet. Don't to don't say. be humble. Thank no, you. you Tell us something. I was, I was just like the first Vixen Angel, like first Vixen Angel of the year. Like I feel like I started with them, but they also like started love Vixen. Vixen with yeah. me. Love like, Vixen, love twist. You ever twisties? I like too. Oh, I love twisties. Love of twisties. course. Yeah. Always in a condo. Yeah. Always in a condo. Twisties. <laughs> something I've noticed. Big Lower PH budget production, guys. you know. Yes. <laughs> okay, now we're getting to the end here. Let's hear some crazy shit. What do you got for us? Horror story. I don't have like, I think honestly the coolest thing I have to tell people is I smoked weed with Seth Rogen. That's like my main thing. I have his signature on my arm. Like that's my pride and joy. Like the coolest thing I've ever done. That is pretty cool. Yeah. And how was he? Was he a cool dude? Did you put it down? Oh my God. No, he's so, he's so respectful and stuff. I don't know. I wasn't going to try. You didn't want to fuck Seth Rogen. I mean, I would have if he would have like tried, but he's married. Yeah, fair enough. So like he was very respectful and I, I, I don't know. I was extremely nervous. Like I was like shitting myself. You know what? Yeah. <laughs> what if I told you? I bet you he was more nervous than me. That's what my him. friend said. Absolutely. But I'm like, I don't. You guys know. don't get it, man. You're right, Ryan. Porn stars are a different breed. Above the number rest. one celebrities in the world yeah. are porn stars. Yeah. I don't why know. are we so lucky let to me, be interviewed? And let me That's tell you this: see when you meet celebrities, are they kind of nervous to talk to you? They are because porn stars are the people that they watch all day. Yeah, in hiding the- and they worship you. And you're scared. scared. I worship him. He made Pineapple Express, which is my favorite movie of all time. Like, I've told him that so many times. But listen to this. You've seen that movie three to seven times. Max. I a, a month. Like, I watch it so okay, often. Okay, even then. Sure. Even then. 30 times. He's watched you 682 times. <laughs> At his most vulnerable know. moment while he's coming. Yes. I don't Think know. About I took that. one, his wife's out, you one know, video with milk. him because I Can't didn't want to, like have my phone in his face I took one video with him and at the video I feel like he went from smiling to kind of like serious and I show my friends and they were like I think he was just nervous like absolutely but I feel like maybe he was like annoyed with me or something I don't know no chance I get nervous what okay are the DMs like Kendra any celebrities in there of course may I guess okay Tyga yes <laughs> yeah. may I guess Tyga we're gonna make sure. a compilation of all your DMs Tyga versus Johnny Sims no did Johnny, Johnny Sims respect Johnny would Johnny win for, like, What's your wait 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 wait? Mm-hmm. Diplo. Um, I know him, but I don't think he was like ever in my DMs. Okay. Like in that way. No, yeah, no. But I've been around him and stuff. Anyone we wouldn't expect? I got one. Hmm. Bryce Hall. No. Taylor Holt. I'm way taller than him. True. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah. When you're a short man, you don't go after yeah. taller women, right? That's yeah. fair. Yeah. Jimmy Butler. No. Damn it. I love him. I wish he was in your DMs. Okay, what who's the one that is fucking get the message, bro? Not interested. Expose him, please. <laughs> um, I don't think there's anyone that I've been like no to. It's Tyga. Fucking Tyga. <laughs> fucking Tyga. I don't know. I have a really embarrassing story with him, but it's like oh. Oh. Spill the beans. <laughs> We're all ears, it's Kendra. So embarrassing. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's hear it. Did you shoot with him for his OnlyFans? No, I just went over there one night like years ago and like I got something on his couch, like his white couch. So I like flipped the cushion and then I looked up in the corner and there was a camera. <laughs> and I was like, God. And, that was damn it. It. and did he ever acknowledge no, it? I never talked to him again. <sighs> okay. But I was just like, did you man, guys? Uh... I think about that sometimes late at night, like I'm in my bed, like taking off my makeup, and I'm <laughs> You're like, losing sleep over that shit. Yeah, I lose sleep over it. I'm like, that's embarrassing. Tell you what happened to me once. I made a at home video. I don't know where this is going. <laughs> Probably where you think. Yes. Uh, you know, photo booth on a MacBook. Yes. We use that to film, and we made a video. Oh, it was very vintage. Uh, I love it. Carly. Vintage. My parents' basement. <laughs> it is. I still use that. It's nice. You can see yourselves on a nice 13-inch screen. No. 13.5. Apple doesn't make 13. It makes everything look big? No. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, uh, we have sex, and then I ejaculated on her breasts, and then I went to the bathroom, and I think I took a call or something, and I ended up standing out there. And then later down the road, I watched the video. You know, I watched the video. And she went like this on my parents' couch in the basement. True story. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
and flip the cushion. You took too long to bring her back a towel. My fault. Yeah, you yeah. took too long. So my friend said. Yeah. They said you could only bring it. It would have dried. Yes. It would have yeah. dried. True story. Yeah. Yeah. She would just be laying there like a fucking toaster strudel until you come back. Like <laughs> literally, like I'm just I can't move because then it'll get everywhere. Like I'm just stuck in that position until you come back. Kendra, when's the last time you had off camera sex? Yesterday. With who? How was it? <laughs> was he African American? No. Oh. Off brand. He was like us. Off brand. <laughs> <laughs> And just an average person. And who was he? An average person. With a fucking 14 inch cock or what? No. Okay. He was like, I, I hope he doesn't <laughs> see this. She's like, oh, it God. was eight inches. God damn. It was, it was average. Okay. And who was he? How did you I feel meet? like I'm turning bright red. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> how did, how did you guys meet? Pink. Who was this lovely man? Bumble, because I'm actually, Whoa, I'm kicked off of everything. You know what's funny is like Hinge, the app made to be deleted, like deleted me. Like how ironic is that? Yes. I'm not allowed on there or Tinder. Do you use the name Kendra Sunderland on Bumble? That's my name. Like what else am I going to use? She's not hiding anything. Wait, your name on your... Drive's license is your porn name? Yeah, because when they posted nothing. the library cool. video, they put well, Kendra Sunderland the masturbates in Oregon career. State Library. And it was right. on the news. Like, everyone yeah. knew me. So. You couldn't hide. Where do we find I would pick Sunderland as a porn name. It's terrible. No, it's fucking awesome. Really? I think your name is Everyone great. thinks, like, Sutherland and stuff. So I just feel like No, I like your confusing. name a lot. I say it. Have you not been saying the whole thing? Kendra Sunderland. Sunderland. <laughs> Kendra Sunderland. That's great pronunciation. Big fan. <laughs> Love it. See, she uses a Fugazi name. I would love to use like a fake name. Miss Chechik, is that your driver's license name too? No, fuck no. Let's see, Madonna, Cardi you're, you're, you're B. You're special. You're a special um, for that. Yeah, good for you. I mean, you I didn't have a retire? choice. You didn't have a choice. But <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's, that's Do you think when you get. retire and you step out of the industry, maybe you'll get a fake normal name? No, I think I'll always keep my name. Fucking legend. I mean, yeah. I want to take like Own somebody it. else's. He last has a fake name, name too. Dark. His name is Eric. <laughs> this guy's a gangster. His real name is Eric. <laughs> Tall white guy with a beard named Dark. You'll never so forget hard. it. I'm sorry. That's a good one. I'm slim shady. Slim shady. Is it because I'm funny looking? We're at 35. This is the Jesus dark Christ. knuckles just really got <laughs> me. They've been going quick tonight. Mm -hmm. Two minutes. Podcast is too short, man. You think so? Yeah. yeah think so too. too short? You yeah. need to go to 50 minutes, and if people on YouTube don't want to watch it, fuck them. Mm -hmm. Okay. You'll still, you'll still get the Should we do another 10? Yeah, yeah, she's beautiful. Oh, fucking Stop. right, bro. Oh, all right, uh, I noticed you. you're, you're... Wait, wait, uh, oh, sorry, go ahead, Dark. That's okay. I noticed you're wearing all pink. Uh, your hair is pink, your shirt's pink, your um, your purse, your Louis Vuitton purse is pink. Uh, is your pussy pink as well? Yes. <laughs> yes? I thought about dyeing my pubes pink one time before Come on. my bush. You should do that. Yeah. They say your pussy is as pink as your ears. Oh. Mm. Case but no one's one. looking at your ears, though, right? <laughs> Did you girls have a fan question? Because I, I told you guys to prep for it. I'm dead. Okay, come on in. These are our good friends. All the way from Ottawa, Ontario. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is so pretty. Kendra Sunderland. Oh, stop. By the way, <laughs> most famous ass in Ottawa right here. Oh, thank you. If thank you could show the viewers. Much. If you could show the viewers. Of course, of course. It's thanks. iconic. <laughs> Yes, very well known. Unreal. Yeah. Another round of applause for Canada. Thank you. They got TikTok. Mm. Oh, I love it. Yeah. I love Big TikTok. So. Great TikTokers. Love your TikToks. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh. So question for Kendra. So the big question is, of course, I've seen the library video. Oh, yeah. Did you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> did you know you were being filmed? And if so, did you put on a show because hot? I did because I was webcamming, so I was putting on a show for like my viewers, but I didn't know that it would get public. Mm, like like at, third point view? Yeah, I, wa okay. I walked away and it was actually like two months later that the video got out, so I was kind of like just as shocked as everybody else. How did it get out? Uh, the, someone in a frat that I was fucking with, like I started telling people that I was webcamming because I didn't care anymore. I was making like 3500 every two weeks for a broke college student. I was like, all yeah. right, fuck all of you guys. Was it Chatterbait? Uh, my free cams, okay. actually. And I got in trouble. The, the library thing was my third strike, actually, because I fell asleep on cam, which, like, on accident, but you're not supposed to do. And mm. then I brought a guy on there, which I knew you weren't supposed to do mm. for them. But, yeah, the library thing was, like, the third strike, and they kicked me off. I have to say, though, congrats. Because oh, legend. Thank you. Fucking legend. Yeah, exactly. 100%. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for They're coming so on. cute. Amazing. 
That was perfect. You went to pee. Perfect time. That was what perfect. Speaking of pee, actually, what? that's a good segue. Oh, uh, I hate this because I'm always wrong. Okay, let's go for this. So, <laughs> do you do squirting in your scenes? No. Can you squirt? No? Yeah, but I feel like it takes a lot of, like, really rough movement, and that's not my thing. Okay, so... Inside. So what, yeah. what gets Kendra to have an orgasm? And the best way, the most loving way, the best feeling, easiest, fastest. The easiest is probably like me on top if you're sucking on my titties and I'm rubbing my clit. Wow. Mm. Probably that. Yeah. But like I'm I'm still and you're moving, if that makes sense. You're still Oh, I see. Like I'm still like I'm straddling you still and like you're doing all the work. I for find focus. when a girl's on top and they want to have an orgasm, yeah. it actually doesn't feel that good for the guy, which is fine. To be honest, I last. Because we have sex for the girl, not for the guy. Yeah, yeah, but it always <laughs> okay. feels good. Guys. No, but they do kind of the scoot chair move, if you know what I mean. You know, when you're, you're trying to get close to the table, the food so just came out. Man up, yeah. grab their fucking ass, bitch. <laughs> you were much nicer on the last episode. You know what we should, <laughs> you know what we should ask? We should ask the I Adriana Chechik question. What do you masturbate when no one's... What do you masturbate to? Like, what... When no one's the judging. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the right answer, but <laughs> dead. Dressed as uh, a mermaid. What's of what's the thing that you masturbate to when no one's looking? When you're low in your room and you're just horny and you want to get off? Mm -hmm. I'm like, when are people watching me masturbate? I get... Well, I don't know. Well, I'm, like I'm if I'm performing, if I'm watching porn, probably like gangbangs. Wow. Black. How do you feel about bukkake? I mean, I like I like to watch that kind of stuff because it just seems so wild to me that like it's hot. Fair. Yeah. It is wild. Can I be Do you not scared to Bukaki babysitter? <laughs> hey. She's like, what give it away? Answer your own question. Is this my interview? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is now. You brought up Bukaki. I like Bukaki. I don't know if I would ever do it to my like let it be done to me, but I absolutely love watching a million mm -hmm. guys do it at once. It's really, I don't know. You know what? I don't, I I don't watch Bukkake. It's it's empowering to a woman <laughs> to watch a man lose his shit. And mm -hmm. I like to I like to watch that all at once. Yes, girl. Yeah. Power of the pussy. Power, P -P. Power, power of the pussy. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Look at how nice her feet are, though, right? Let's let's admire for a second. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that guy Weird. who asks for feet pics. Okay. What are your like strangest them. requests on OnlyFans? Do people like your feet? I mean, yeah, people love feet. I've had someone that like wanted me to make fun of them for being fat, and then later on they told me they weren't even fat. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. That's good. I don't know. I watched <laughs> someone fuck a vacuum. Oh, that's really weird. Oh my god, remember Officer Doofy? That's another. That's a reference. <laughs> he fucks Aww, a vacuum. Doofy. Yeah, Officer Doofy reporting <laughs> for duty, I sir. Love him. Yeah, you know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> he fucks a vacuum. Anyways. In like what way? Do people ask you to Turns dick? it on and puts it on his dick. Oh, because mine was like the handle. Ah. It's from oh. Screen, from the screen movie. Oh, Do people ask favorite. you to, to uh, dick shame them? Yeah, all the time. Mm -hmm. Apparently that's very common. Really? Guys will send pictures of their small packers. I and, feel and... like me, because I've done so many black scenes and like that was a part of my brand for a while is that People just love to be cuckolded by me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My ex was a cuckold. So... Whoa, 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 wait a second. Oh, you opened up a can of worms. Here we go. <laughs> Your ex was a cuckold? Mm-hmm. Okay. He's the whole reason I got into like doing blacked and stuff like that. Oh my really? God. Yeah. Of course. Please elaborate. He likes black dick. I don't know what else to tell you. Did you ever what was an average <laughs> night of a cuckling? Um, one time we were in Vegas and he tried to bring one of the Chippendales dancers back for me, but the guy ended up wanting him more and stuff. So was I he kind of he's a handsome like, boy. He was black. Your ex was black? No, my ex is white. No, his yes, ex. I know. Is there black her ex loved there? So, watching so, black guys fuck her. Did you ever do this? Okay. Mm -hmm. You hire somebody. What do you call that? Johnny Goats does it. Uh, the main guy that fucks you. What do you call that guy? A male escort. Yeah, your your yeah, ex is the cuckold, and the guy it, fucking you. What's his name? The cuckold. And the... Yeah. What what is he labeled? Oh, as? Roost. No, not a rooster. Anyway, what's he labeled as? I forget what. It, what's yeah. his name? He has a name. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, have you ever done this? <laughs> okay. Kicks the door in, grabs your boyfriend, the cuckold, throws him in a cage, and then he pretends 
to rape you while he's locked is in a cage. Is this a fantasy? No. Yes. No, no, we have a friend who does this once a week this. with apparently one of the top politicians in Canada that we know very well, but he signed a million NDAs and he cannot tell us who. And he, right. and he gets paid top dollar to do this, to rape. <laughs> and it's every Thursday night at 10 o'clock. Yes. Once a week like for 10 and he, years. And he sits there in that cage and loves it. With a top, with a top. <laughs> See, this doesn't Politician surprise you. I can tell by your facial no. expression, it doesn't surprise That's you. That's like a normal. That's pretty normal. Normal apparently. kink. Not normal to me. Like, civilians <laughs> no, think agree. like liking feet is like so weird, but I'm like, that's the most normal like of them all. The cuckold like. thing to you is normal. Yeah. Incredible. I get it. So have you guys done that? That that the cage? Not the cage thing, no. I feel like he liked to feel like he was in control. Like he liked mm. to feel like he set it all up. I'll tell you what I did once in Cancun. It's got to be some sort of it. Part of, it, part of it, sorry. I did something in Cancun once. It was a girl who was rooming with a, a gay man. And I wanted oh to God. have sex with her. She's a very pretty girl. Her name was Kendra, actually. No, it was uh, Kate. Uh, Start with a K. <laughs> Anyways, Cancun 2013. I'll never forget. And I said, you want to go back to your room? It's during a day party. I wanted to do a day thing. And she said, the only way I'm having sex on this trip is if my gay roommate can be involved. <laughs> and I said, how involved are we talking? Because I'm not homophobic. We both have blowjobs from transgenders. Uh, well, I, we were fooled into doing it, but yeah, anyways. And I think guys cool. are good looking. Yeah. Not gay. Totally cool. I've made out with dudes for fun. Yeah, yeah, for jokes. Remember that? At that party one time? I made out with Taylor Page. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> we're talking three minutes. Yeah. Wow. Anyways. Hey, back to your story. Very comfortable. So, <laughs> so she said, as long as he doesn't have to touch you, but he will be involved. <laughs> and I said, no problem. Hmm. We don't touch. That's fine. I'm cool with it. So what we did was we were having sex missionary and he kind of was kneeling right behind her head and he was jerking off right above her face and looking at me right in his eyes. <laughs> so you were looking back into his eyes? I didn't really look. <laughs> How'd you know he was looking into your eyes? Because I would peek up. <laughs> I was like, this guy's still looking. Make eye contact for yourself. That's my closest thing to a cuckle. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Did you like it? Seems like it. I bet you he liked it more. You're very specific. Probably. I did like when he came and it kind of, it didn't touch me, but it was close. <laughs> Guy had good range. <laughs> but I did that. I did that. That's awesome. He's yeah. proud of it. <laughs> Never told you that one, Derek. Yeah. I, when was I going to hear that one? <laughs> yeah. You're an Right idiot. now. <laughs> you fell for that. Still fucked. Yeah. 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 <laughs> True. With cum almost on your belly. Almost. It's okay. Someone else's. Yeah. And you, you almost shot me once too in Vegas with uh, good range. <laughs> <Why are you? laughs> oh, I'm always avoiding cum coming to face. That king me size too. bed was just big Said enough, straight, huh? man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do we got, Jinxie? Fifty. Fifty. Go Holy shit. Okay, Kendra, us. tell them where to find your Instagram, your OnlyFans. Uh, all of it. All your, your platform socials. that you're on, your browsers, whatever. Go oh on. my gosh. Okay, my Instagram currently is the real KS Library Girl, Twitter KS Library Girl, <laughs> OnlyFans.com slash KS Library Girl. My website is Kendra Sunderland VIP.com. Mm. You can search me on Pornhub, search me on browsers, and buy my flashlight. Ooh. Oh, oh wow. Ooh. Please. Fucking cool. It's shaped as your vagina. Yes. yes. How cool. was the molding process, by the way? I have it's a like. It's like you have to like use a vibrator to get yourself like turned on, but not like come. So it's like blood flowing there. And then yeah. they like plaster it like a, like a mold. Like you're going to take a mold of anything really. It's 2022. Yeah. Like, Evolution of technology. Yeah. yeah. That's so We're really mean. going in the right direction. Yes. Yeah. It's yeah. pretty cool. It's like hot and then warm, like hot and cold and hot and cold. And then when they peel it off, it feels really good. Hmm. It's interesting. But I they don't mold the inside. That's a common like. Thing that yeah, you guys it's just think. the lips. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's just, just what it lo visually looks like. The inside right? is oh. like swirls and bumps and stuff. Wait, like that. can you do? Do they do a pussy pump on you at all? No, you're just pussy supposed pussy to use like pump. a vibrator, just oh. to get you a little fired up. Yeah, just enough mm -hmm. to mold. Yes. Fair. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. It's your babysitter for joining us, Ashley Skies. Of course, thanks for having me. <laughs> Great OnlyFans content. Yes. <laughs> Might be shooting with the girls soon. I hope so. Hope so too. Dark Ryan Pillow Talk. See you next Tuesday. Thank you, you cunts.